Irish wages are low by comparison with our European neighbours. Irish productivity is high. Irish company profits are rising. At the start of this recession, official figures showed about one in every 20 people at work was suffering from deprivation. This means not being able to afford very basic things like heating your house or two pairs of shoes. Five years later, uh, the latest figures show this number has gone up by two and a half times. Now we're looking at one in every six people at work suffering from deprivation. The Irish people have been patient enough. The government are introducing stealth taxes while cutting everything around us. The cost of living gets higher, but the public services get worse. All at the same time, our wages stand still. Our life is for a living, not just survival. It's time we get a pay increase so we can start living again. But it seems to me that just the price of things just keep going up. You're talking like the NCT, the car tax, the kids' clothes, the kids' fees, their clubs, their this, their that. Yet the, the wage still stays the same. We deserve a pay rise. I'm a cleaner in a major hospital in Dublin. When times are good and people were getting pay rises in the other sectors, us cleaners got nothing. Then times are bad and we all struggle together. We got nothing still. Now times are on the up, I think we deserve a pay rise. Employers and government representatives say there's no scope for pay increases. Instead, they want to cut taxes. But this measure will not benefit low-paid workers. It will only suck money away from public services. We have a crisis in our public health care system. We have a housing crisis. Our mental health services are stretched. Six people are becoming homeless in Dublin every single day and our poverty and deprivation rates have soared as people struggle to get by. Tax cuts would not address any of these issues. Pay increases would. Pay increases for workers on low and middle incomes will put money back in their pockets. They'll spend more in local shops, bars, restaurants and other local businesses, creating more jobs. Wage increases will help to lower poverty and deprivation rates. With more people at work and fewer on social welfare, it will also mean higher revenues for the government so we can afford better public services. If we were to get a pay rise, we would be spending in our local shops, restaurants, which in turn can turn the economy around and it would support local people and local workers. It may even create jobs. If we have money in our pockets to spend, it can create jobs and it can get the wheels turning again. Currently the state is subsidising low-income earners with family income supplement. If these workers were to be given a pay increase, then that money could be better used and channeled into a good public service. Irish wages in the private sector are actually lower than the average of the EU15. And when you combine that with the high level of productivity of Irish workers, we discover that uh, wages are very much more than competitive. And this is reflected in our big export surplus. We've never really, ever since the crisis, had any problem exporting. We've always exported more than we've imported. So that the real problem with the economy since the crisis is in domestic demand. Let's make sure 2014 is the year Irish workers get a pay rise. Join the movement to increase Irish wages. Get organised, join your union and get active today.